Hey, you traders, Shane from Gen 2 Futures and FX. Welcome back. Today, I want to take you through how to clean out your cache. Now, your cache is something that uh, that obviously can affect your trade station platform, the operation, the running of your trade station platform. Loading up data will take longer, and you can also get situations where your trade station platform crashes. So, one of the things, if you ring up the help desk at Trade Station, they will advise you to do is to clean out your cache or, or delete your cache. So, we're going to go through that today because it's a it's a it's a process you should do at least once a fortnight once a month and uh, obviously you want to do it when you're not trading so uh, it would be the end of the uh, end of the session when the markets uh, close for that short period or you could potentially do it on the weekend so either way you want to clean that cache out uh, on a regular basis making sure that uh, that you've got the ability to load up charts and that that run seamless and obviously if you've got a lot of data in your cache that's going to slow that process down when we do this our charts are going to open up a lot faster our platform is going to be more efficient so so let's go in and uh, and delete our cache so the first thing we're going to do is close down trade station now I'm running Windows 8 on this PC so I need to go into my local directory and my, my C drive so I'll click on that you can see there I need to clean a few things out on that three drive because it's getting a little bit full now what you want to do here is you're into uh, the PC you're into your local drive C and you'll find that you've got two program folders you want to go into x86 so we'll double click on that and just down it's obviously in the alphabetical order down the bottom here you'll see trade station folder now mine's 9.1 you may have a later version let's double click on Trade Station 9.1, and we're looking for the program folder. So if you go down, you'll see program folder here, and right at the top of that, you typically will see the cache. Now that's what we want to delete. So we'll just right click, and we're going to delete that cache. So we've basically deleted the cache. Fantastic. We'll close it down. Now we're going to go back into Trade Station and see how quickly these charts open up now that we've cleared out our cache. Okay, we're back into Trade Station now. We'll open up a chart or a workspace. We'll grab, say for example, PT14. We'll open that workspace up and that should open up fairly quickly now for us because we've cleaned the cache yet. Now remember that uh, perfect, that's fantastic. So a nice, clean, quick open. Uh, if you get the yellow data sign up there, that's pending data. Because we've cleaned out the cache, it's obviously collecting and rebuilding that data now so it's going to take a little bit of time for all the, for the data to come in but the charts will run better your uh, you'll be able to open more workspaces and everything will be a lot smoother and you might get you you typically won't get that frequency of the system crashing so that's just a little quick tip video for how to clean out your cache uh, thanks for watching and uh, we'll look for I look forward to catching up with you in a later video today cheers